Jesus chooses 12 disciples to be apostles. There were many people who became followers of Jesus and listened to his teaching. Men and women gathered to hear what he had to say. They included fishermen he had called to follow him and a tax collector. Sometimes the crowds became large. One day, Jesus went up into the mountains alone to pray. He spent the night talking with God. Jesus needed to decide on 12 men who would be with him all the time. It was these 12 men who would be sent out in pairs to preach and to be witnesses of his resurrection. The next morning, Jesus called the 12 men he wanted to be his disciples and apostles, and they went up to him. The word disciple means a learner or follower. The word apostle means one who is sent out. The first four were fishermen who Jesus had invited to follow him. One was Simon, who Jesus later renamed Peter, meaning rock. Jesus also chose Peter's brother Andrew. Andrew had left John the Baptist to become a follower of Jesus. James, the son of Zebedee, was called to be a disciple of Jesus. As was his brother John, Jesus nicknamed them the Sons of Thunder. Philip had been one of the first to follow Jesus and invited others, like Bartholomew, to do the same. Bartholomew, also known as Nathaniel, was once described by Jesus as a true Israelite in whom there is nothing false. Matthew had left his job as a tax collector to follow Jesus. Thomas, who later doubted that Jesus was alive until he saw him, was chosen. James, son of Aphaeus, is sometimes known as James the Less. Little is written in the Bible about him. Simon was called Zealot. He may have been zealous or once belonged to a group of zealots who wanted to get rid of the Romans who ruled the land. Thaddeus was also known as Judas, the son of James, and as Labaius. Jesus also chose Judas Iscariot, who later betrayed him. These were the men constantly with Jesus, learning what he had to teach them. They traveled everywhere Jesus went, and were also sent out in pairs to preach, heal, and cast out demons in Jesus' name. There had been twelve tribes that made up the nation of Israel, and Jesus chose twelve disciples. All but Judas Iscariot would be his apostles and leaders of the early church.